what's poppin', what's happening, what it is, what's good, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back to the back, to the back, back, back. I've been on top for a while, now it's time to the moon, fast car me gon' run. To my channel, and if you're new here, hi, I'm T, welcome to TV, and I hope you enjoy your stay. If you haven't clicked that subscribe button, what are you doing? Go ahead and click it, because we stay litty over here. In today's video... Oh, let me be quiet. In today's video, I was already doing this in my hair, and I was like, why not film this? I'll be giving y'all a little mini twist. Twist my hair with me. I don't know what I'm going to call it yet, but I know that's what I'm going to do. Then I'm going to give y'all a couple ways to style it. So, you know. Oh, and I'm also going to be trimming my hair as well. So, for this, you will need a comb to part your hair. I will be using the Palmer's Coconut Oil Formula. Coconut Oil Hair Milk Smooth 24-hour treatment this is the extreme firm hold one of course you're gonna need a water bottle and if y'all can see my water isn't clear because I have this in it which is shea moisture manuka honey and yogurt hydrate and repair multi-action leave-in so um handful but it looks like this I'm gonna spread this down because you know you're gonna be parting and you don't want to part on dry hair because your hair breaks I want to start with the bag straight parts but obviously i can't do it so i'm not gonna stress myself out baby we is in quarantine what i'm stressing for <laughs> give it a little spray spray Put about that much on each section so after you spray spray you're going to want to moisture moisture next you're going to want to split your hair into threes because you're going to start out with a plait and go into a twist trust me trust me on this so you're going to want to split your hair into threes you get a little past halfway you're gonna look at your hair and see which one has like see which section has like the most hair or the longest hair gathered and then you're just gonna split that in half like that so now what you're going to do get a little bit more of that moisture moisture add it to the ends tightly you're going to start to do a two strand twist and of course coil at the end the next step is optional because like i said i am trimming my hair so i check my ends out and i look so when you're looking at your ends you see the hair that's not really coiled like it's just out there that's what i trim off stretch it out And cut it now you have a perfect coil because you chopped off those little straggly ends and that's what we're going to do to our whole head
Spray my whole face. So I'm gonna continue doing the back, and then I'm gonna come back to y'all to show y'all how I do the front. <laughs> And like I said, I'm gonna have this little section at the top so I can show y'all how y'all need to do the front of your head. But before I do that, I'm gonna give y'all a little, a little, a little, a little look, whatever, whatever. Let y'all see the top, whatever, whatever. Cool, cool, cool beans. But with the top comes a little like, I don't know, like technique. Not technique, but you know, you just want to be... You know how I said in the back, it doesn't really matter how you part it. But in the front, that's where you want to really part it nice and neat and make it look nice. Because that's what people gonna see when they look at your face. Basically, you're going to want to do what you've been doing. You know, your water and your leave-in. Spray, spray, spray. And then you want to go ahead, get whatever you're using to moisturize that head. Put that all up on there. Here comes the part that is critical. This is the part that y'all need to listen to, okay? Take that edge control. Get edge control. You can try Eco Styler if your hair is like not as thick, like you have the, you know, the thinner, finer hair types. But if you have like the coarse, thick hair, get an edge control. Take that edge control, take that finger, give it a little tap. Literally, that's all you need to do. Now, you're going to take that, okay? And you're going to slap it on there. On the roots of it. Get it on the top and both sides. You can do it on the bottom, but that's a little too much. That's to control it and make it look neat. If you just do it without the gel, you, you have natural hair. So, it's going to look, you know, a little puffy. Especially if you're from the 4C area, you know, type 4 area. It's going to look a little puffy. So, you're going to want to add the edge control, right? And then you're going to take it. 
split it in threes. You know the vibes. You know the deal. And when I say you're going to braid, I mean not braid, but you're going to plait from the root. You're going to plait from the root. Like you want it to be tight because that's how you make it look neat. And make sure you plait in like the direction you want it to fall. Don't plait it in the, in the wrong direction because I did that a couple times. But yeah, you just want to plait it. You see that in? You see that perfect coil? That's what we like to see. That's healthy. That is healthy. Ladies, stop holding on to those, those, stop holding on to that heat damage. Stop holding on to that damage, those damaged ends. Cut it, get rid of it, it's hair, it will grow, okay? Trim those ends, stop holding on to it. It's, I know when your ends ain't trimmed, that's when you got your most length or whatever. But baby, health over length, okay? That's all I'm gonna say. All right, so I'm gonna give y'all a look so y'all can see what I'm talking about, like how neat this looks. But y'all understand? Y'all see how neat that looks? That's how you want your top to look, okay? And then, of course, you have the back. Now I'm going to give y'all some hairstyles to do. Here's the first style. Looks like this. Next, you know, you pull out the two piece, the two piece half up, half down. We love that. We love that. So you have the two piece half up, half down, where you got the two hanging from the top, and then the rest is just down. You know the vibes. And then you can put it all up in one pony, which I'm not gonna do. Now, how to keep these fresh and nice and pretty. Get a scarf, wrap it up at night. Like, put it in a ponytail, that's another way how to stretch it. Put it in a ponytail, wrap, put that scarf on. And then, of course, put your bonnet on after that. If y'all wanna know where I got this bonnet from, I got it from Dollar Tree. I have a Dollar Tree haul, y'all can go check it out. Every day, you wanna take your spray bottle with some conditioner in it, every single day, and spritz your hair. Give it a little spray spray. And of course, you're gonna wanna oil your scalp every day. Here I have the tea tree jojoba oil, hair and scalp oil, it looks like this. I usually use the uh, dual grow oil, growth oil, but I can't find it right now. But make sure you're oiling your scalp every day or every other day. Healthy hair, you're gonna wanna take your vitamin, vitamins. Here's my favorite vitamins, which are the main choice. Healthy hair, vitamin, metabolism plus. Longer, thicker, faster complete nutrition hair if you're using this as a protective style this is a very good way to grow out your hair also make sure you're taking your vitamins oiling your scalp and protecting your hair i hope y'all enjoyed make sure y'all like comment and subscribe and stay tuned for my next video turn on your post notification bell so you're notified every single time i post because we're lit over here all right if you haven't checked out my sheen haul my last video or any other of my videos make sure y'all go and check it out because what are you doing and yeah remember stay Letty. Bye.